Hey, what's up everyone? In today's tutorial, we're going to be replacing the evaporator fan in my Samsung refrigerator. All right, so if you're not sure how to get to this point, seriously, watch my other video. I do all of that, uh, it's really simple, okay? Once you watch that video, and no, I'm not just trying to get clicks. But hey, since you're here, hit that subscribe button. All right, let's look down here. We're in the freezer, the door is off. We're gonna be operating back here, all right? What we need to do is take off that panel there. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna screw there. You have a screw there, that's it. I'm gonna get this taken off, and we're gonna get this ice maker taken off. There's just two screws for that right here and here, and then the back of here. Uh, hopefully we can see it, give me a sec. Tight squeeze here. Um, we're gonna have two connections back here. One's gonna be the water line coming in. I think that's gonna, this one here, we don't wanna take that off. There's gonna be a blue one as well. You're gonna to wanna to take that off. All right, so this ice maker, uh, the ice machine, ice maker, whatever you're gonna call it. Uh, I was mistaken, it's not a blue one. It's a white wire with a blue connector here. So what you're gonna do is you're just gonna squeeze that in, pop that off, and then we're gonna get this back panel off and get to work. All right, now that you have that out, uh, the ice maker out and everything like that, this part's pretty easy. I'm hoping you can see me do this. You're just gonna kind of pop up a little here, pull out. All right, you're not gonna damage it, you know, be a little gentle and it's gonna slide down, okay? Now, once it's sliding down, let me get out of the way. You're gonna have a connection back here, all right? So flip it this way and you're gonna see it uh, right there, all right? So you're gonna undo that clip take that off and there we go now we have the panel off on the back side is that fan with the motor all right let me get this set up we'll move into the part where we take this off i'll show you my replacement part we get it put in we should be good to go okay so what we want to do first is if we look here we're going to be replacing this so we have to trace this wire right we want to get it out of here um, so take these little areas here, uh, you can just kind of snake it through, right? Just remember, you're going to want it to go back in, in a similar way. So take a picture or for me, I'm shooting a video so I can always go back and check. But yeah, you want to get this unwound, unwrapped. All right. And get that undone, un get that completed first. All right. One more little twisty turn there. I'll just push that out of the way. All right, to get this thing taken apart, all right, you're gonna you're gonna look for these points here, right here. And this foam, this styrofoam is gonna be over this, so it's kind of confusing. Peel that back. You're gonna pop this tab out. You're gonna pop this tab out. This guy, this guy, this one. All right, and you're gonna do the same on the side. There's tab, a tab there, and a tab there, and the same on the other side. Now that I've popped those off, in theory. I just popped one back in. Uh, we should be able to lift off this lid, all right? There's the replacement part, all right? Pick this up on Amazon. I'll link it in the description. All right, so we got three screws there. My wife came down to help out because, well, if you know me or you ask anyone that knows me, when I get frustrated, things get broken. So, yeah, we're going to take these three screws out and theoretically should be able to pop this fan out and replace it. You're gonna pull these through this way. All right, almost it's the exact same thing. Watch the holes not line up. Looks like it's the same connection. So, screws from the old one. Yep. So you're gonna to wanna to reuse the three screws from your old fan motor. All right. So like I said, I said it a moment ago, you wanna get these wires fed through before you start putting this back together. So you want to get this on the back side. Just get it through that same opening you had. All right, now it's gonna pop out where these are, okay? So feed it through there. You should be able to set this back down. Now line up your stuff. So this might be a two-person job. 
someone hold the wires. The other one flip. All right, so everything's back in place. What you can now do is, I'll do that off camera. We'll, we'll feed this all the way back through, okay? All right, so before I put this back on, I wanted to verify that the fan is working. It is, heck yeah. It was working before. Now, one thing to point out is this little, where it plugs in, that little junction there, I don't know what to call it, that connector. Make sure it doesn't pop out. Uh, try to keep that in there nice and tight. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna get this door put back on. We're gonna see if we hear the sound when we close it up. Hopefully we're good to go. Fixed it. No noise now, sounds nice and quiet. Uh, hopefully this works. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments. Make sure you're hitting that subscribe button, sharing this video with other people, and uh, take care. Thanks for watching.